What's up guys? Today we're going to go over a very basic fundamental sweep uh, from the open guard when your passer is kneeling. Uh, I may have mentioned in a previous video, I consider there to be three categories of guard. The first is open guard when your passer is standing. The second is open guard when your passer is kneeling, which, will we do, which is what we'll be going over today. The third one is closed guard. They're all different. They all require different retention methods. They all re have different sweeps and submissions available from those positions. Butterfly sweep is a very, very strong sweep, and it's something that every white belt should know. So we're going to do two grips. The first one is going to be the strong grip, okay? So butterfly guard is here where I've got both feet in. Um, I can also be here and initiate the sweep, but basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to punch for a deep underhook on one side. And on the over, other side, I'm going to get a nice overhook where I'm pinching that arm to me, making it so that she can't post out when I go to sweep her. So I'm in here. Maybe I'm hand fighting, snapping the head. Maybe I pull her down and I punch deep for this underhook here. Okay. Now this arm is going to go around and I'm going to grab here. Okay. I can go like this, but I prefer to come here, right? Grab the tricep and really cinch. All right. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this foot on the overhook side and I'm going to bring it just across, right? Instead of going underneath her leg, I'm gonna bring it across just like this. Now, the biggest mistake everybody makes here is they fall backwards like this. There's no sweep here, okay? I can't take her over here, okay? No, I'm going to tuck and fall to the side. I'm gonna push off the mat with this foot and kick her over, just like that, okay? And now I follow through and I can end up in the mat. If she scrambles to defend, I might end up in side control or if she brings her knees in very quickly and turns in, I might just be in the top of her open guard. Still an effective sweep. So we're here again, right? She's here, okay? We're hand fighting, right? Maybe I snap her head down and I punch through. I get a deep overhook, a uh, deep underhook on this side. Now, on this side, I come over. I'm already in position. I'm gonna push off this leg. I'm gonna elevate her here, fall to the side, kick over. Now I follow through, finish in the mouth. One more time. Just like that, and I follow through. Now, the weak grip is easier to get because a lot of people will stay in very tight position with their elbows, make it very difficult for me to punch for that deep underhook, right, realistically, when we're hand fighting. So instead, I'm just gonna grab here, okay? I'm gonna grab tricep and head grip. Obviously, I'm not as tight. This is a weaker grip, and it's less stable. However, it can still work. Now, I'm gonna steer her with the grip this time. So I'm gonna steer her this way. And again, right, bring this across, kick over, go all the way here to the mount, okay? So those are the two variations I use for the butterfly sweep, right? Marcelo Garcia was a person who basically made this sweep very famous. He hit it on almost everybody, right? He has excellent timing with it. And it does take a lot of time to get your timing down to that high degree of proficiency. Now, the other thing with this is, even if I don't sweep them, they still need to base out and post. And so I'm causing a reaction they need to defend, and then I can capitalize it and move on to something else, right? It also happens that sometimes when I'm attempting my lateral drop, all right, so stand up, coach. So we did this with Nick, right? Maybe I'm coming in for my lateral drop and I miss, I don't get deep enough. Maybe she brings her butt back really far. So I come here and I fall. Well, maybe I can finish it with that butterfly sweep instead of just sitting in the guard and accepting it. So uh, you can combine that sweep kind of with the lateral dropper if you ever end up in that position, you know, in that over under position where you're grounded because you didn't get deep enough on the throw. You can sometimes finish it with that butterfly sweep. So hope you guys like the video. Make sure you subscribe if you're new. Make sure you click that notification bell. That way you guys get notified every time we have new videos. Make sure you share the video and I'll see you guys next time.